Sandra Annette Bullock is a multiple award-winning Hollywood actress and producer. So far, this very successful lady has appeared in a number of high-grossing films like Gravity, The Blind Side, and The Heat, becoming one of the most bankable actresses. Born to an opera singer, Bullock's parents ensured that she attended music and dance classes as a young girl. She played small roles in her mother's opera productions and developed a love for performing arts. She sang with a children's choir and actively took part in stage productions while in high school. Deciding to pursue a career in acting, she studied drama in college and appeared in several student films. Success, however, did not come easy to her in spite of her good looks, poise and talent. For a while, she supported herself by working as a bartender and waitress. She started her acting career by appearing on stage productions before moving on to films. She worked in a string of independent films which led to her being cast in mainstream Hollywood films. One of the most popular actresses of the 1990s, Bullock is the recipient of several prestigious awards, including an Academy Award for Best Actress and a Golden Globe. Childhood v. Early Life She was born on July 26, 1964, in Arlington, Virginia, USA, to John Bullock, a United States Army employee and his German wife Helga Mathilde Meyer, who was an opera singer and voice trainer. Bullock is of mixed answers TL. For the first 12 years of her life, she was raised in Germany and Austria. As a result, she can speak fluent German. She began performing small roles in her mother's operas from the time she was five. She eventually fell in love with performing arts and started performing regularly with a children's opera. She went to Washington Lee High School where she was a cheerleader. She actively participated in the school's stage productions and graduated in 1982. She enrolled at East Carolina University to study acting. She graduated with a degree in Bachelors of Fine Arts and Drama in 1986 and moved to New York the same year in search of acting jobs. Subsequently, she took acting lessons at the Neighborhood Playhouse Theater. Career During her initial days as an actress, she appeared in a number of student films. She acted in a stage production of No Time Flat and her performance got her noticed, leading to opportunities to play film roles. In her first film role, she appeared as Lisa Edwards in the 1987 film Hangman which revolves around the assassination of a U.S. senator and its aftermath. During the late 1980s and early 1990s, she appeared in films like Love Potion No. 9, 1992, The Thing Called Love, 1993, and Fire on the Amazon, 1993. Her breakthrough role came in 1994 when she was selected to play Annie Porter in the action film Speed, which also starred Keanu Reeves and Dennis Hooper. The film was a huge commercial success. In 1996, she appeared in the film adaptation of John Grisham's novel A Time to Kill. The film had Kevin Spacey, Samuel Jackson, and Oliver Platt playing important roles. A Time to Kill follows the story of a black man who avenges his daughter's rape by shooting white rapists. She reprised the role of Annie Porter in Speed 2, Cruise Control in 1997. The film, which was a sequel to the 1994 movie Speed, was about a couple vacationing in a luxury cruise ship which gets hijacked by the villain. It was not as successful as its predecessor. She appeared as Gracie Hart in the 2000 comedy film Miss Congeniality in which her character, an FBI special agent, participates in a beauty pageant in spite of being a complete tomboy. The movie was a commercial success. She reprised her role as Hart in the film's sequel Miss Congeniality 2, Armed and Fabulous in 2005. However, the film was not as successful as its predecessor. She was part of an ensemble cast of the crime drama film Crash in 2004. The film was about racial tensions in California and was inspired by a real-life incident of carjacking outside a video store. She has appeared in several successful romantic comedy movies like Two Weeks Notice, 2002, The Lake House, 2006, and The Proposal, 2009. In 2009, she played an important role in the semi-biographical sports drama film The Blind Side which was about the story of Michael O'Hare, a young sportsman from a broken, dysfunctional family. The film also narrates O'Hare's adoption by a concerned couple. She appeared in The Heat in 2013, which is a buddy cop comedy film. She plays FBI Special Agent Sarah Ashburn who is teamed up with Boston Detective Shannon Mullins, played by Melissa McCarthy. She lent her voice to the documentary film The Prime Ministers, The Pioneers in 2013. 
In 2015, she voiced a character named Scarlet Overkill in the movie Minions. Bullock appeared as Debbie Ocean in the 2018 film Ocean's 8, a spin-off version of Ocean's 11 franchise. The film opened to mixed reviews, but was a commercial success. Her next film Bird Box, 2018, in which she played the role of a protective mother saving her children from supernatural entities, received universal acclaim and her performance was praised by many. Directed by Suzanne Beer, the film was a post-apocalyptic horror thriller. Major Works Her movie The Blind Side, which narrates the story of Michael O'Hare, an offensive lineman who plays for the Baltimore Ravens of the NFL, is considered one of her best. Her performance as Lee and Tui was highly praised and won her several awards. She was nominated for an Academy Award for her role in the science fiction thriller Gravity. In the film, which was directed by Alfonso Cuarón, she played a medical engineer who embarks on her first mission in space. Awards v Achievements She won the Academy Award for Best Actress in 2010 for her role as Lee and Tui in the movie The Blind Side. She won the Golden Globe Award for Best Performance by an Actress in a Motion Picture, Drama for her performance in The Blind Side. Personal Life v Legacy She married Jesse James in 2005. However, she divorced him in 2010 when she found out that he had been cheating on her. She has an adopted son named Louis Barta Bullock. In 2015, she adopted another child, a daughter named Layla Bullock. Since August 2015, Bullock has been rumored to be dating photographer Brian Randall. She owns a production company called Fortis Films. She has donated $1 million to the American Red Cross on at least five occasions. She donated the same amount of money to help relief efforts in Haiti after an earthquake. She also donated money to Japan after the 2011 Japan earthquake. In 2017, she donated money to the Red Cross relief support after Texas was affected by Hurricane Harvey. She was inducted into the Warren Easton Hall of Fame in 2012 for her donations to charities.